What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. We are here at Devin's shop and we are gonna do some more car stuff today. We are in my Evo. There's a few things I have to go over that we have to fix. First thing is the wheels that I have on now and I'll show you guys. The wheels I have on now are wheels that, here I'm gonna sit back in here because this is so bright are wheels that came on the car when I got the car and they're extremely bent. We think it's the front two that are really, really bent. So I'm gonna try to get those straightened out back to normal. There's a wheel shop here in Spokane that um, does that kind of stuff. So we're gonna make sure it's just the front two. Hopefully it's just the two. If it's all four, then it wouldn't be worth it. So we're gonna do that today. And then for the time being, I'm gonna take the wheels off of Devin's abandoned Evo and use those for a while. Eventually I'm gonna get new wheels anyways. I don't mind these wheels that are on the car now, but I just want my own style. I'm so excited to make this car like me, my own, my own thing. So we're gonna do that. I hear Devin coming down. Guys, he drove my car today. He literally drove my car and he's, this is what he looks like right now. You coming baby? Doggy. Can you explain what's going on with my AFRs? Oh, a little bit lean. So there's actually two fuel pump relays on this car and there's one in the engine box. I can't even talk right now. A fuse box in the engine bay that a lot of times goes bad and they had recalls on them. So we're gonna take the fuel pump relay out of my half wrapped car, throw it in here and see if that fixes it. So in shorter words, we're gonna replace that with Devin stuff. <laughs> You're always stealing my shit. I know. I'm that's what I do best. If this relay is bad and you steal mine, you're gonna order a relay today. Cause if I go to start that car and there's no relay in there, you're in deep, deep doo doo and you're in timeout for 10 minutes in the corner. <gasps> what else do we got? Are we doing anything else in my car today? I'll check your fuel pump. So, and I didn't tell you guys that whenever I fill up my car or try to fill up my car, it really only fills up 75% full. About 66% if you're going to be exact. <laughs> so we're going to figure out what's going on with that. And then I'm also going to steal something of Devin's again. What, my wheels? And I already told him I'm taking those. Right. I'm only borrowing stuff, baby. So Devin's abandoned Evo is up on stands. And I'm just going to take those for a while. <laughs> Borrow. Peek, mom. <laughs> okay. As you guys saw, Devin and I were trying to figure out how, or we were trying to figure out what wheels were bent, and we, uh, he ended up figuring out that this one was bent. This one's the worst. That front one's bent a little bit. And this one was bent a little bit. So we're gonna send these two in and these two are fine. Stock Evo wheels and tires on Z car. And they look better than the grids that are curb rashed. Yeah. And farty. <laughs> they honestly don't look terrible. I like these wheels. Yeah, not bad, not bad at all. So like I was saying guys before, my gas tank was only filling up like 75% ish full. So Devin is taking a look at the fuel pump, which is under the seat down here. It could be going the opposite way too. You could be filling up all the way, mm -hmm. which I'll see in a second, and going down to half tank, but your thing's reading us empty oh. when it's half tank. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I'm pretty sure this float tells your tank when it's full or empty. Mm -hmm. So Devin and I ended up figuring out what the gas thing was. So there's like a little floaty thing that floats in, in the gas and it rises up to tell you if the gas tank is full or not and we think it was just caught on something um Devin was messing with it earlier in one of my first videos when we were working on this car so yeah we think that was it but now it's my gas tank is full so that's good now what baby Pop your head. okay 
<clears throat> let me get set up. It, All right. it takes me a minute. I just don't want a third gear fatty pull. I can't get my flip flop off, damn it. Here. I got it. Yeah. My hands hurt now. Your hands hurt? No, icky. No. Down, Daniel. It's so loud. Okay guys, so we just got done going on a little drive down the road just to kind of see like what was going on with this car and if anything had changed when we had switched a few things from Devin's car over to my car. And long story short, I'm pretty sure this car just really needs a tune. Um, the AFRs are still really, really, they're pretty low from what Devin's been telling me. One more thing, one more thing that I'm going to switch on this car. Devin is inside right now, so I'm taking Devin's Shifter Nova off the Evo 8. Yeah, so this is the one that came with the car, and it's just not my style. So I think Devin's going to put this one in the abandoned Evo. It's a little big, but yeah, last but not least, those are the mods we're going to do for today. Guys, if you made it to the end of the video, thank you so much for following me along. If you haven't, hit that subscribe button. Remember, hit that subscribe button. And remember, hit that thumbs up button. I've been doing a lot of car vlogs lately, and I really, really like it. It's actually a lot of fun. But anyways, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye!